what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. As you can see, I'm in a new room. Still in the process of moving. You might hear some hammering in the background and whatnot um, from my buddy who is uh, hanging up some stuff. So, yeah. Today, though, I'm bringing you an episode of Max That uh, on the Town Hall 9. As you can see, we have a whole lot of Dark Elixir. Um, I've been using this new army composition. Uh, I started using it on my Town Hall 8. But I'm now using it on my Town Hall 9. It's working really, really well. It's uh, I'm calling it the Wizarian Attack. It's Wizards and Barbarians. Um, and that's pretty much all. But it's 16 Wizards and then the rest Barbarians. Um, your Archer King or your Queen and King um, and whatnot. So let's go ahead and look at... As you can see, all my attack logs um, have all been with that attack. And I've won pretty much every single one of them except for that bottom one. Um, well, I don't remember what happened on that one. I think there was a dragon in the clan castle or something. But you can see all those is two star, two star, two star, three star right there. And you can see the good amount of loot I'm getting. This one right here up at the top is um, almost 700,000 and whatnot. But um, I threw some giants in the mix there for a while, but then I decided to cut that out and just keep using barbarians. Um, but what we're going to do today after this attack is I have enough elixir or dark elixir to upgrade the king to level 40, uh, which is awesome. Uh, you can go back into these attacks and see the the uh, dark elixir that I've gotten on some of them. I think, yeah, like that one right there, 2300 is really, really good. And then all the other dark elixir kind of adds up. Um, but mainly I'm just looking for the other loot as well so that I can upgrade some more stuff. We do have a maxed out archer tower up here right now that is level 11, so that's awesome. Um, hopefully next weekend or sometime this week I'll try and stream for you guys with the rest of these gems. Um, but why don't we go ahead and go on the attack. I'm going to see if I can um, find a good base and uh, we'll see if we can get back to you in a little bit, but this one doesn't look bad at all. Um, I might be able to attack from the bottom. Or his and his heroes are both down. Um, so I think I'm going to attack from the bottom over here and uh, see if we can work our way in. It looks like he has a bunch of stuff that's upgrading. Let's go ahead and let's see if he has anything in his clan castle. Um, looks like he has some archers. See if we can pull all of them out. And we can, come on, keep on coming. <laughs> There's so many of them. All right, and then we're going to try and bring them over here because I'm going to... Uh, lightning spell this mortar. If we can get them on top of the mortar, then we can kill a hundred archers with one stone, if you know what I'm saying. Um, so we're going to try and get them right over there on top of the mortar. Um, Alright, good. So most of them are on top of that mortar right there, so we're going to drop both of those. Take out that mortar right there. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, that's absurd. Alright, um, let's bring them back up here. See if we can get them in range of this other mortar uh, right there. Now nah, they're going to run right by it. Let's just go ahead and take out that mortar right there. Um, I don't know why that, what? That one went down, but the other one didn't. That's fine. All right, so the way that it works is we just spread out a bunch of barbarians along the bottom, and they're going to take all the fire for us. Um, and then we drop off wizards like that. I'm going to go ahead and drop my barbarian king over here too because I really want to get in there to that mortar. Um, and take it out because it is doing a lot of damage that I was not expecting uh, to have it do. So we're just going to keep on spreading out our barbarians down here along the bottom. Um, our king is working his way in doing some awesome work. Hopefully our wizards will stop just running around and actually go after that wizard tower um, right there. Come on, go after the wizard tower. You got it. One more shot. Alright, so now that wizard tower is down. So this whole bottom section is pretty much going to be ours now. Um, I need the wizards to focus on that expo right there. Good. So that wizard should go in and take out that whole expo. <laughs> the whole expo. It's only going to take out half of it. Um, and why don't we go ahead and use the rest of our barbarians up here. We're going to use our archer queen up here as well. Um, and see if we can't get in there to that dark elixir drill. Um, and then the rest of our troops down here are just going to keep working their way around up and in. Um, and then let's go ahead and drop off our queen as well. Good. She's going to run in right there. And then she is going to help take out that elixir storage right there. Um, we have this lonely little wizard taking out this gold storage right here. We're going to let our archer queen go down a little bit and then we're going to use the cloak ability right there to get some other archers out there as a distraction. Um, you can see we're at 64% and we might even be able to take out the town hall as long as these wizards stay up from those mortar blasts. We should be able to take uh, three mortar shots and there's the town hall. So look guys that was a pretty good base 
And with that attack, I was able to get two stars um, on it. So it works really, really well with just four lightning spells. You take out both mortars. For some reason, I noob on that first mortar. Um, and there's the raid, 233,000 elixir, 287 dark elixir, 91,000 uh, gold, and then 20 trophies from that too, which is awesome. So try it out. It's the Wizarian attack. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm the first person to do it on YouTube. Obviously, I'm sure that people have tried it before, but I really like it. Um, it's been working really, really well for me. So you just start off with four, and then I go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then I just spam... Uh, I just spam barbarians and the rest of it, and uh, yeah, that's generally it. But it's been working really, really well. Uh, I mean, you guys just saw that I was able to get two stars with it, which is awesome, especially on a base like that that was pretty well upgraded. Um, definitely better than than a lot that you might find. So uh, with our dark elixir, we are going to go right over here. We're gonna heal, not heal him. We're gonna upgrade him. So four days, twelve hours. Um, and he will be done and then we're gonna have our second ability level so every five levels you get a new ability level so um, in four days we're gonna have that which is gonna be great definitely super excited about that I'm going to be saving up my gold for probably another archer tower maybe uh, I think definitely another archer, archer tower I'm not really too worried about air defenses right now I definitely want my archer towers up first uh, our clan castle is gonna be done in three days sweet I can collect some stuff Nice. <laughs> and all of our Teslas are maxed out as well now. So I'm going to keep using this Wazarian attack. If you guys want to see an all hog video, let me know because now that they're maxed, I'll probably just do a whole, an entire hog raid with heal spells um, and just wreck house, whatever. You guys can see our bikes in the background back there. Um, but yeah, so I just wanted to thank you guys for watching as always. I hope that y'all. Uh, are having a good weekend. I hope that you did have a good weekend. I'm still moving, like I said. Um, but, hey, there is Boom Beach. So, yeah, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Y'all rock. I really do mean that. And, hey, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later.